What's up, Juno? And also, if I die, that just means I'll have to... I'll have to... Means I will, uh... It appears I miscalculated my e -tank the odds of your ability to escape that trap. You are, however, too late. Eden was activated as soon as I entered this room. It cannot be deactivated as long as I, the master key of this island, remain here in this control room. All that remains now is to wait for Eden to enter transmission range and send the command to execute the reinitialization of this island. Once that command is received, the 10,000 workers aboard Aiden will execute it immediately. My estimates indicate their work will be completed in less than five minutes. There's big things falling from the sky. Let's just stare at it. Some people are about to get independence aid. Now that Eden has been activated, any further interference from you will remain on file, thus tarnishing my operating record. Fortunately, you are suffering from memory loss and fragmentation. Therefore, as keeper of this island, I hereby exercise my prerogative of correctional dispensation. Prerogative of correctional? What? Allow me to rephrase. I will exercise my authority to terminate your program. Ready? Charging me, asshole. Phase two. My, my. It would appear that I have made an error. No! You were nearly successful in terminating my life support subroutine functions. But do not be disappointed. It appears it will take longer than anticipated for Eden to reach its optimal altitude. If you can terminate me before then, you will be able to stop it. Assuming you are capable of deactivating me. Remember that mural in the museum? Our 
Are you ready? Are you ready? this move. Still in this, kind of. Damn it. Jump too early. Snatching defeat from the jaws of victory. Fucking do that in my Miramasa rec recording too. Like the hardest enemy layer, and it was like pixel with the uh, last enemy, and it fucking killed me. Good luck. Ugh. It's fine. I'll refill my canteen this time, and it'll be all Gucci. Already downtown, though. Let's see. Yeah, I'm still missing some canteen packs and the Kevlar Jacket Omega. But yes, if you grind it up enough money, then yeah. Juno's a fucking joke. I mean, he even saw from just that fight there, and I was kind of unfamiliar with the uh, moveset. It's just circle strafe and jumps and jump sometimes. That's about it. And I'm also not wearing the helmet. There's an argument to be made against the helmet, though, because it prevents you from getting knocked down, which is an invincibility state, and it knocks you back, which is not an invincibility state. So by resisting the knockback, you're technic the knockdown, you're technically taking more damage. If it's a multi-hit, anyway. I mean, like, this enemy has no chance of actually beating me. 
but it takes like 20 seconds to kill each because they just sit there and block. Oh, but when I do this with the shining laser, you'll see, um, yeah, the shield don't mean shit. Like, basically, the fierce deity mask wish wishes it was this fucking broken. I thought maybe I shouldn't talk about Majora's Mask because I never finished it. And probably never will. bothering. Hi, data. Bye, data. Shouldn't that slam up to three times, but Ready? it's actually kind of weird. He normally does that. Ready? Like, I'm not used to these single jumps. a no-hit phase one, bitch. My, my. It would appear that I have made an error.
much for my no-hit. But yeah, he can fuck you up. Later, man. It appears I was in error assuming that a bureaucratic model such as myself would be able to best you in hand-to-hand -hand combat. However, I was successful in keeping you occupied long enough for Eden to achieve optimal altitude before you could interfere. This is Mega Man Juno, Bureaucratic Model 3rd Class, Authorization Number 8677, requesting a reinitialization of this island's systems and a memory backup of its bureaucratic systems. Stop! Stop it! If you wish to shoot me, please do not hesitate. My program has already been backed up in Eden's central Core. I eagerly await my next activation. Eden Systems ready. Awaiting confirmation. Requested backup of bureaucratic model Mega Man Juno complete. Execution of Catalog's reinitialization program will commence in 100 seconds. What should I do? Interrupt command. Priority command rerouted to Purifier First Class Mega Man Trigger. Under suspicion of malfunction, Bureaucratic Model Third Class Juno has been deactivated by Mega Man Trigger as per Ordinance 103. Mega Man Trigger hereby requests the indefinite postponement of the previous reinitialization order and the deletion of bureaucratic model Juno's backup data. Trigger hereby assumes all bureaucratic authority for the district and will petition Mother for guidance at a future date. Command reroute acknowledged. Priority given to Purifier First Class's command. Eden resuming standby mode and returning to pre-designated coordinates. Deleting log of Purifier First Class's correspondence as required by security ordinances. Requesting that notification to Mother be carried out by Purifier First Class, present bureaucratic authority, trigger. Data saves the day. Tuh. Data? There's nothing to worry about anymore, Mega Man. Everything should return to normal shortly. Do you know who I am? I'm your peripheral memory storage device. You originally created me so your memory couldn't be scanned by Mother 2. I can't tell you anything yet. But soon I'll be able to tell you everything. What you are, why you lost your memory, your original function, and mission. Mega Man! To be continued Mega in Man! Mega Man Legends 2. Blasted contraption. It's always breaking down at the worst time. Mega Man, are you all right? Yep, I'm just fine. Gramps and I were working on the radio forever, but couldn't get it to work. Mega Man, you won't believe what we saw. I'm glad these old eyes of mine lasted long enough to see it. Calm down, Gramps. He's been like this ever old since... Old ocular receptors, huh? maybe? Mega Man, are you all right? Oh, uh, it's nothing, really. I'm sorry that I scared you. You're always running off like that, making me worry myself sick over you. But somehow, I know you'll always make it back. I have faith in you. 
Thanks. See you soon. Data, let's go. E -e -e. Ready, Mega Man? Ready. Roll. Tell me, do you really have to go so soon? After all you've done for us, please stay a while longer. We haven't had the chance to thank you properly. Well, if you haven't financed the rest of my projects. Stay. It's just that we've got some unfinished business that we've got to take care of. Right? Yep. That's right. Besides, now that we've got a refractor for the flutter, it's time for us to go. If you must go... Won't you at least come to town and say goodbye to everyone? Hmm. I suppose we should at least say goodbye, eh? Hey, Mega Man, why don't you go? Give him our best! It would mean so much to everyone. Go on, Mega Man, and say goodbye to the Junkman's wife for me. Okay, I'm going. Yep. Epilogue where you actually get to say goodbye to people. You know, how about I do the epilogue after I show you the shining laser bullshit? <laughs> Just so you can see how utterly obliterated Juno gets, it's fucking funny. And before my data got erased. In a world. It's shiny, and it's a lot of bullshit. <laughs> Just in case I screw up, I'll get my uh, E-Tank filled. I suppose I could just save that data before the fight, but whatever. All right. Time to show off what multiple hours of grinding can do. I guess you can't go through the shields. Lame. 
lame. and that thing does damage. And it does about my buster's worth of damage every single time. Shining laser is silly. You know what? Fuck it. I don't care. You know, it's just in the way. on the guy up here. Later. Yeah, this thing sucks at aim, by the way. Sometimes the hits just don't register. <gasps> and this is why I filled up the canteen. <laughs> busted. All right, let's uh, let's go say bye to people. Yeah, I just took some stupid damage, but if I actually had the helmet on and the Kevlar vest, then uh, I'd take even less and it's even more of a joke. So if you max out everything, it's like a walk in the park. It's like in an RPG when you do all the like optional bosses and shit. And then the like main bad guy's an absolute joke. Yeah, this is about the only physics object in the game. That's probably why it's so amusing to kick the can around. And why it's really funny that you get money if you, uh... Make it the bakery's problem. Okay, that's a new one. 
I've never gotten it stuck on the counter before. <laughs> oh well. You named your kid Mega Man. Why is your wife still pregnant? What's up, Paprika? Because you can tell them your name is Hippopotamus, they still call you Hippopotamus. It's always funny. Hi, oh, yeah, she's awake. training program. Yes. Let's call it basic fucking education. God, they're so stupid. What's up, Wiley? Boatman Wally? Oh, hey, it's Earth Lady. But it's your day off. Why are you answering your pager? everybody from downtown's already there. And everybody from uptown too, so I guess yeah, you just say goodbye to the people in here. Still cool. Let's see if I can actually get it in the bakery this time. Apparently making that can the baker's problem is called is considered recycling.
Oh yeah, that's the runner game show guy. Yep, that's the dude who lost his money. They weren't really robbers. Yes, they were. They took money from the bank and they tried to get away with it. That is a robbery. <laughs> Mind you, they're much less nice to you if you uh, go to Lone Karma. I don't remember all they say, but I'm pretty sure either none show up or they're just like good riddance. The faster you play and the harder it is, the easier it'll become. Basically, if you beat the game on hard mode, do you get a buster unit that maxes out all your shit. Yep. Thank you so much for your help. Take care of yourselves. Bye. Take care. Goodbye. See you later, Amelia. about your mom and dad or the mother load well it can't be helped it's not like we meant to come here in the first place right but everything worked out in the end right yeah hey mega man did something happen while you were underground huh yeah well not really don't worry about it well i don't know but <laughs> Don't ever forget that I'll always believe in you, okay? Roll! Mega Man! Roll! Look outside! The island! Mega Man! Okay! What is it? Whoa! Roll left! Left! Huh? Okay! Hey! Isn't that... Bye. They all came to see us all! I hope those of you at home are watching. Our brave heroes are taking off, heading for new adventures. As you can see, the people of Catalogs have come out to send them off and wish them well. Hey, everybody! I don't think they can hear you. They were all really nice people. Maybe we'll come back here and see them again. Yeah. Okay, setting new course. Here we go.
and then we get some credits. In about an hour, we'll be arriving at our destination, Catalox Island. Double check your equipment readings and make sure everything's in working order. I swear this treasure will be ours or my name's not Bond. Let's do it! But yeah, it's still weird that they used the two, uh... I'm not sure who messed up what line, or even if that's just a, like, localization thing, but like... They, they simultaneously know, and they didn't know that the mother load was here. Like, Roll just said, oh, we just happened on this island, and Mega Man just happened to pick it, and... Oh yeah, this was the place we were looking for the entire time. Like, it doesn't really make sense. Get that 
meanwhile. Well, there they go. Not a care in the world. Hey, Tron, can't this thing go any faster? No, it can't. I had to gather up all the spare parts from everything he blew up to build this. That's right, that's right. We'll just have to rough it until we get to the next island. If we sell what we found, we'll get back what we lost and then some. We'll live like kings. Yep. They got the Who massive refractor. There was such a huge refractor down there, and all we had to do was just wander in and pick it up. I told you we'd have the last lap. <laughs> That's assuming we make it to the next island without sinking. Oh well, at least he's in a good mood. Pretty bold of them to put it to be continued when there was uh, no indication that it would be. In a world so yeah, as Data said, if you start a new game from here, then you start on hard mode. Which is the same game, only the enemies are tankier and you take more damage. So it's not really hard, it's just more tedious. Anyway, that'll do it for this stream. Just wrap this up, I might uh, do something else later. Don't know. Either way, um, yeah, wrap this one up. Check out the YouTube channels, Ty's House Gaming for long plays, Ty's House VODs for stream VODs if you don't want to look at the uh, Twitch VODs for whatever reason. Discord's in the bottom right. And I have got nothing else. <laughs>